we have a pleasure that we have been able to invite Rodri Morgan today. He has been here, but in a different circumstances in 2001, when uh, there was a big earthquake in Gujarat which affected quite a few of our community members. And he, at that time, he, he graced us with his presence on the Remembrance Day. The Mandir had been set up for about 27 years now. And during that year, the members have grown both in intellectually and spiritually. To give a brief idea of the new building, this used to be a nightclub we had to revamp the whole scenery. Perhaps if you remember back to 2001, it's quite different from those, those that time. Uh, we were also grateful to the Welsh Assembly because we had a grant of 120,000 pounds. Thank you very much. I must stress that it was not because of religious purposes, because the Monday does activities other than religious activities. Uh, there are quite a few that we, uh, we also provide advocacy and, and, uh, and, and, if, and information for our younger and for the elder, elderly, elderly persons also. The minister was not able to come for our big celebration 25th anniversary uh, because his diary was quite full of and we were on a daily basis. We come into the temple and come into the shrines and then we pray. Like any other religion, within Christianity, Islam, any other religion, there seems to be a, then you notice both knees are touching the floor. The arms are stretched out to the front. And if you notice, when they stretch their arms out, they're in the cross. <laughs> On the ladies' side, Anmol Vadani. Just a quick announcement, uh, if the Lazium and Band team can also be ready uh, after the awards. <laughs>
and to be open to people of other religions, of no religion, and of community and educational use. I think that's also right, because there is a very old principle of Tiger Bay, the old Dockland areas of Cardiff, which is one of the world's great sort of temples to diversity in its own social maker, in which the number one principle of everybody who lived in the old days in Tiger Bay was we celebrate each other's festivals. We don't just celebrate our own festival, we take advantage of the fact that here we have a lot of people with different festivals, sometimes like Eden Dee Valley, they are very close together in their dates, sometimes they're not, that doesn't matter. We all enjoy and celebrate each other's festivals. Now that was a principle of the old part of the London, and it was a signal that the worst of the sleep of the snow was over, and that they were shortly to be um, in our flat in Pennington and they would be okay for the next couple of days, which was, which was nice. Anyway, it was like a precursor for the family when I rang them at 11 o'clock to see if they got there. Uh, they said, yes, we got there and it was nice when we arrived in London to see this huge fireworks display. I also understand that you are going to be having a fireworks display yourselves later today between 8 and 9 to celebrate the Valley in Cardiff. I was fascinated to be giving the certificates um, uh, to the students in the Gujarati school that you run because it reminded me very much of the way Welsh medium education started in Cardiff 75 years ago, believe it or not, with a Saturday only school, um, which I was a founder member of as a small boy of four during the middle of World War II. And there were about 20 of us who went to a Saturday morning school so that we could play in Welsh and learn Welsh um, hymns and songs and poetry and we could play together in Welsh. And it's quite strange when you think about it now uh, that what you're doing in the Gujarati temple since last year in having a school to help keep your culture and language and traditions alive was exactly what uh, Welsh-speaking parents like my parents did three quarters of a century ago, also in the middle of Cardiff, although that was on the other side of Cardiff, near the Lord Mayor's um, uh, home. This was in um, Richmond Road, Gordon Road, next to the, um, uh, the Lord Mayor's uh, mansion. So um, I also noted, um, which I am told is coincidental, and is, but of course it's very similar to the Halloween festival, which will be taking place in this country um, on October the 31st, which I think is coming up Friday now. I don't think Halloween has a very religious connotation uh, in, uh, in the United Kingdom, but I do have to tell you that I am very proud. For the first time in my life, I've grown a very large pumpkin, and so my grandson will have the opportunity to have a pumpkin grown by his grandfather. I am temple here in Winter's Place in Cardiff. It's a very proud day for you, and I can tell you that it's a very proud day for me to be with you here today. Thank you very much for the evening.